What is happening everybody? Josh here from Spawn Flyfish and we are back with another shop update here from Ilwaco, Washington, Spawn Flyfish HQ. Alright, so we're going to start things off in a little different order today. We're first going to give you the report from the water. So we've mentioned this over the course of the last several shop updates about low water continuing to be a theme, continuing to be a problem. It has become so problematic that all, almost all of our local rivers are now closed. WDFW uh, released a statement closing the rivers to protect those fish that are on their way to the spawning grounds and those fish that have not yet come into the systems that will then make their way to the spawning grounds. So we are hoping for rain. Fishing was really, really good, but it's gonna be even better when we get some rain and we are looking forward to that and looking forward to the rivers being back open. Uh, all of the lakes locally have recently been stocked. So all of our lakes here in the greater uh, Iwako or Southwest Washington area have just been stocked and fishing is nuts. Uh, you can, if you have uh, a watercraft, we do recommend using a float tube or something that can get you uh, away from the edge. But if you're still fishing from the shore, you will look to have success. So be mindful of that. Uh, if you come down here for a clam dig or on just vacation. The last thing is jetty. This is the last weekend to target rockfish. So the end of that bottom fish season is upon us. It was a phenomenal season. As I'm sure many of you guys saw, Pete and I spent countless hours out there catching countless rockfish. So it was an awesome year. Hopefully we shed some light on it this year and hopefully next year many, many more of you guys join us out there off the rocks. What's new here at Spawn Flyfish? We got several new products here in the store and we have every color of teal flank feathers from Hairline. These have yet to hit the site, but we have had several individuals in here picking some out and getting their teal feathers here at Spawn Flyfish. For those of you that follow us uh, across all social uh, outlets, you'll know that we had a very unfortunate situation last week here in the shop. Uh, we would like to thank the Long Beach Police Department for all that they did. Uh, and we will no longer be accepting checks here uh, at Spawn Flyfish. It's something that we feel uh, good about making this decision moving forward. Whether or not you have your ID present, we will not be accepting checks. So that segues into keeping your stuff safe. We have another new product here at Spawn Flyfish. The Sea Run cases we mentioned earlier that they were coming, they are here and they are awesome. These things are bulletproof. So if you want to keep your rods safe, you want to travel with your rods, bring your gear with you. These things are excellent. We have several models here in the store. So be on the lookout for those uh, on the website. You can call anytime and get one or come and see us here in Iwako and check one out today. As far as dates to remember, the tying class is full. So we have capped that off. We are really excited about those of you that signed up uh, and stay tuned for the next one. We will announce that we'll be tying a different pattern uh, and continue to have those as we move into fall and winter. So be on the lookout for that. The only date that we still have on the books is October 28th, 6.30 PM at Fort George in Astoria, Oregon. We will be uh, featuring the the film The Game uh, by Todd Moen of Catch Magazine and we can't wait to have you all there. It's going to be a ton of fun uh, and it's going to be everything that uh, we hope you think it will be. So that really wraps things up here in the shop and for our weekly update. We look forward to seeing you guys next week and don't forget to hit like and subscribe and thank you for tuning in.